So how are you doing, Olsingham? That was pretty dramatic stuff, don't you think? I enjoyed that. There's a little bit of fun with myself tonight. I hope you don't mind. Oh, that's good. I put that there, thinking that I'll drink it when I sit down. Um, as you probably noticed, I'm five minutes late, so I've actually been gagging for that. Okay, hi, Altringham. How are you guys doing? What have you been up to? Uh, I, as usual, I'm not sure how long this live will be. Uh, it'll be as long as it chooses to be. Uh, let me catch up with you guys in the comments here, because oh, this happens to me every time, doesn't it? So, right, okay, I'm ready to go. So, hi, Altringham, how are you guys doing? Um, this will go wherever it's going, as the normal Wednesdays do. I'm going to talk a little bit about what's going on here for Altringham News, and that's Altringham and with Chris. Um, a little behind the scenes stuff. Uh, and whatever comes to light, I suppose. Um, you may have joined me yesterday uh, with it being World Mental Health Day. I decided pretty much spur of the moment to do uh, a live yesterday, going back to the mental health stuff that I've been talking about a few weeks earlier. Uh, I do intend to make that part of uh, these lives if you guys want to stick with me with these Wednesdays. I'm willing to give it a go. Are you? Give me a chance, eh? So, yeah, maybe a little segment of Wednesdays, but not this week, I don't think. Some of you might know I didn't have such a good day yesterday. Uh, I'm over it. I'm okay. I'm getting there. Feeling pretty up today by comparison, so not everything's bad, eh? Just going to make a drink. Ah, incidentally. Somebody commented on the uh, Sunday video, well, uh, Chris. Wearing a London top when this is all dreamed of. So, in response, top your off, okay? Oh, I hope that wasn't offensive. Um, funny, I was just talking to my mate about political correctness earlier on. But, hey. Uh, do you have an opinion on political correctness? Because if you do, and you want to take part, you can in the comments on this video. Or, if you'd like to be a little bit more vocal, then you can do that on 07-874-055-611 whatever you want to talk about uh, Hi Chris, thanks for being uh, thanks for listening to him ramble on last night yeah Chris called us last night uh, talked us a little through some of the issues he has going on um, I suspect you may hear a little bit more from Chris I don't mean that in a funny way but Chris did say yesterday that he'd like to talk a little bit more about it. Um, I think we'd like that. Uh, he, he also said, we've been trying to arrange this for a while, uh, the Ocean News team and Chris, to hook up and have a drink, because he's a local lad. Uh, Lincoln, I think he's in now. Uh, driving trucks up there. Uh, yeah, we're, so we'll... we'll Trying to hook up, have been for a year or so to have a drink with him. Um, we're going to make it happen and maybe we can get him in here. I know he'd love to join us, so perhaps we'll see if we can make that happen. And that was a lot of rambling just to say, hi Chris, thanks for being there, wasn't it? Because I've forgotten what I was saying. But yeah, a little segment maybe on Wednesdays. Uh, otherwise, these Wednesdays, like I say, join in if you want to, if you have anything to say. It will be as long or as short as it wants to be. And I remember saying Sunday that I'm going to try and keep away from those and the vicar set to the tart lines that I set myself up for, but there was another one. So, okay, altering your news. What's going on with altering your news? Uh, there's a few things that I know Chris would want me to tell you. Um, we do have a new member of the team, uh, I'm not sure if the name's out there, or whether Chris would want me to, so I won't, just yet. Um, working a little bit behind the scenes, and we're hoping that on Sunday, uh, she'll be able to join us in the studio. Um, She's a little unsure about being in front of the camera at the moment, but if she joins us on Sunday, we'll see if we can entice her over this side and come and say hello to you guys. So, 
If the name isn't already out there, then find out. Let's see what happens on Sunday. Talking to Chris, uh, I know he wants me to remind you that tomorrow morning at half past eight, he's starting a new breakfast show in place of his walks around Oldshingham. You will see a walk around Oldshingham here and there. We're thinking Saturdays at the moment because that's a busier day. Uh, it's lighter because Chris's walks were taking place at night. So it's a bit lighter and there's more places open obviously so we might be able to pop in and say hello to one or two people around Oldshingham and one or two of the businesses. Can we pop in and say hello to you? Let us know, get in touch. Um, we'll do that. So Chris hosting the breakfast show, check Chris out, uh, tomorrow morning 8.30, he's going to take it on location. Uh, the first one will be here in the studio, but I know Chris has plans on taking it on location. When he comes back from his two week jaunt over to Cornwall, with uh, I'm going to be on my own for two weeks, to trust him with this for this place for two weeks, come on! And yes, before anybody says anything again, it is only tea. So, yeah, I left that shit behind long ago, and that's, uh, well, that's <coughs> one of those five minute segment things. So, people, join in, please do. Whatever you want to talk about, I'll drink in 07874 055 611 if you'd like to speak up and you like the Christmas socks. Don't ask. Um, yeah, 07 874 055 611. Uh, please don't try that number out of the live stream screen times as a couple of people have tried to. Uh, I can see a few hungry faces flying by there. If, hey, do you know what? I don't like Hollyoaks, so I tend not to watch it. Not rocket science. Uh, I don't know, what are we saying then? He's, that's old age for you. Yeah. yeah, anyway, waffle, 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 waffle. So Chris taking his breakfast show on location. Uh, I was, was I talking about that? Was I talking, I was talking about visiting businesses in Old Trinidad, wasn't I? So yeah, if you'd like us to pop in and say hello, then we're more than willing to do that, get in touch. Chris would like to do his breakfast shows from perhaps a different location every morning. Um, maybe you could make it a review thing, Chris. But I, th I think people would like to see that. So watch out for that tomorrow morning. They're away for two weeks after that. Uh, what I'm going to do with those two weeks, I don't know. Uh, Chris, you will see some of Chris while he's down there. I'm sure he'll be doing his own streams here on Ultra New News. So watch out for those and let's see what we can do with it. As, like I say, as for these Wednesdays, if you want them to carry on, if you'd rather I did something else on a Wednesday like not be here, then that's fine with me. All you've got to do is tell me about it. Uh, so folks, quiet on the comments as usual. We uh, Just Chris commented at the moment. Now, these Wednesdays are quiet, so uh, I'm going to persevere for the time being. I don't care. I've often known to talk to myself about lots of things. Because I, I could sit here and talk to myself all night. I, I'll bore you, it's fine by me. But what else can I tell you about all the news that's going on? We are still looking for your help, particularly on that old Tringham. Uh, we see that's Altrincham as an entertainment channel. We'd particularly like to see your own videos on there. Whether you share them with us via YouTube, whether you actually send them to us. Have you got a talent? Are you talented? Uh, are you a local band that would like to? Wouldn't it be cool if a local band would do something specifically for us? That, that's the sort of thing we want on That's All Tringham. If you've got any other ideas for it, then please get in touch with us. Facebook, Twitter, All Tringham News, That's All Tringham. Take your pick. Um, let's have a look what we're doing. 
and you never know, there might be something that interests you there. Uh, I'm going to speak about Mr. and Mrs. Altrincham as well. If you've been with Altrincham News for a little while, you might be aware that a little over 12 months ago, there was some controversy surrounding Mr. and Mrs. Altrincham. Uh, also at the time, there was a bit of a battle going on between a number of Altrincham online presences, should we say. Fortunately, all that silliness has died down now. Uh, the extremes it went to were <laughs> memorable, <laughs> should we just to say the least. But uh, it's all behind us now and you guys are taking us seriously and we take that seriously. Uh, we appreciate your support, I certainly appreciate your support here. Uh, I, I just want to do something that entertains me and entertains you. Um, get involved with us folks, please do. Especially that's altering you. Um, are, are you a comedian? Send us your videos, send us your links on YouTube. Let's have a bit of fun over there, it's all about entertainment. Uh, when Chris comes back, You'll see a bit more of the community side of Ultimate News here on the Ultimate News channel. Chris is one of the Ultimate hosts that you might have heard of. Uh, they, they attended the Goose Green Festival, they were managing there. Uh, they're involved, they will be involved with the Christmas celebrations coming up in Ultimate uh, Ultimate News and all that's old Tringham, I imagine, will be there as well. So, yeah, you can cap, you can catch up with us there. Yeah, guys, I just want you folks to get involved. As I just said, you guys are taking this seriously, and we do take that seriously. We want to make this what old Tringham wants. So we need you to tell us what you want, and let's see if we can make this fly. The phone number for tonight, if you have anything to say about what I've been saying, there's another on your face, well, then give me a call, I'll tell you what, give me a call and tell me how crap you think it is, 07874 or comment down here, sometimes, I've got this crappy old phone and sometimes it doesn't do quite what it should do, so let me just check that I haven't actually been missing any. Uh, Chris, how about a walk down Atlantic Street? It changes every time. Do you know what? Yeah, why not? That sounds like a good idea. It's certainly changed since. So why are we doing putting that away? Well, if you get us away, I can't do that. It's certainly. Hi, Joanne. Yeah, it's certainly changed since I was a kid. Uh, my granddad used to work around there at, at what I call the poo factory. I'm sure you know. Well, I, mean, I actually got told off for it the first time I said that. But <coughs> I've still got that man flu from a couple of weeks ago that's dropped under my chest. Uh, yeah, it, it's changed a lot. I've worked at a couple of places around there. Uh, worked for a taxi firm on Dale Street, which no longer exists there, at the back of the shops. Uh, I, I struggle to remember what was behind Dale Street, where the actual car park is now hi Katrina how are you doing uh, yeah I struggle to remember what was there as I do Nelson House that's been so I don't I used to travel a lot through simply I don't know uh, not because I choose not to but that's the way things are Nelson House I grew up just over the bridge from there and I can't for the life of me what remember what was there before Nelson House but I do remember them building it but again, it shows how old I am. As does uh, a conversation I had with uh, somebody today, this morning. <laughs> I won't say who it is, I don't think she'd appreciate me. We, we, we realised how old we were. We had a meeting with Chris and an individual this morning. Uh, my dad worked Dowding and Mills. God, how long were they there? For, uh, for 52 years. You worked at B&Q? Okay. Yeah, B&Q recently closed, hasn't it? Which surprises me. 
Uh, wear all the cheap clothes that we've got. Yeah. So yeah, well, I think that is a good idea, Chris. I think we'll have a go at that. I walk down Atlantic Street. We, we do tend to focus with the pictures more on Goldfinger Centre, I suppose. Chris certainly likes his old Goldfinger pictures. Uh, so yeah, Chris, thanks for suggesting that. I'd like to give that a go. Maybe I'll do it myself. Uh, I walk down Atlantic Street, so people. I, I know that a lot of you guys who watch these lives. Uh, I watch you from overseas and used to live over here in Altrincham and I know you appreciate the old pictures so perhaps a walk down Atlantic Street might be interesting to a few people and see what's going on down there. So we'll make, I tell you what, I'll make you a promise, while Chris is away for those two weeks I'll make sure that happens over those two weeks so it's something that I can take on and do so job's already done. Right guys, it's 10 to 9, uh, I've managed to waffle for a little bit, uh, thank you for joining me, I'm going to keep going a few more minutes. There's those angry faces again. Okay, look, just... alright, but well, as Chris would say, do you undo like buttons down there, it's it. Uh, yeah, guys, so, if you want to give us a call before I leave, 07874. 055-611, the number's also up there. I'd like to say way up, but no, the comments are that way, aren't they? So it wouldn't make any difference. So, 07874 055611 if you'd like to give us a call. Uh, you can also tell me to as far as you want me to in the comments if you so choose. It's, uh, it's no skin off my huge nose. Uh, yeah, game go on guys, as I've been saying, with us here on um, Altrincham News and that's Altrincham. We're approaching the autumn season, uh, Chris is doing his live tomorrow morning, 8.30, so everything's starting to fresh. Okay, we have one, we did have one. Right, okay, I'm willing to take your call, I'm doing this single handed tonight, but I'm giving it a go. Only in a few more minutes though, because I don't want to bore you to death. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Okay. So, why don't you join Chris tomorrow? Give him a try. Give him a chance. 8.30, he'll be here in the studio, but then um, when he's back from his holiday, he will be taking it out on the road. Uh, we'd like to visit a few places. As we would like to visit a few places on a Saturday, we think Saturday, in the afternoon, pop in and see a few of the places out and around Altrincham, check out some of the... Uh, Humongous amount of coffee shops around Altrincham because it's getting a bit chilly out there, isn't it? So, certainly walking the streets, not too sure about that. So, one more time, guys, before I'm out of here 07874 Just a few more minutes if you've anything to get off your chest about the angry faces that you were throwing at me. I don't know, there's the number, it's up there, in the comments, because I bet that's gone cold now, aren't they? These trams, I can still hear these trams. So, okay. I think my time here is done for this Wednesday. I will, whether you like it or not, be here next Wednesday. Uh, so, get used to it for the time being. I've been asking you all along to get involved, please do, your videos, things like that, or any fresh ideas, get in touch with us, Facebook, Twitter, that's Altrincham, Altrincham News, whatever you fancy, our personal Facebook and Twitters, you know our names, you know where to find us, you can find Chris and myself over there, Chris is at one Chris Oldfield, myself at Andrew DK, if you want messages or private messages on there, and whatever, just get in touch, tell us where you want to see. Altrincham News go, and um, that's Altrincham. Even if you want to see it disappear up the arse of Satan himself, then that's cool with us. Hello? Hello. Oh, hello. Hello. Do you think we had a shy one there? Quite possibly. Okay. 
think I'm done. The comments are quiet tonight. The phone's been quiet. I've gone up from that. As I say, I will give it another go Wednesday. I'm going to persevere for as long as until some sniper takes me out on the way out, if that's the only way of stopping me. Join Chris tomorrow at 8.30. We will also be back on Sunday for Chris's final one down here for a while. Certainly his final Sunday. We'll be trying some split screen stuff while Chris is away as well, so that's going to be fun. We tried it once before, we eventually got it to work. So if you, if you see some funny stuff going on on the page, well, if we give it a try just to see it at any point, then you know what's going on. So, hey. Alright folks, it's five to nine. I'm not going to stretch it out any further. I've... <sighs> You've heard enough of me for now. Thanks for being there, Chris. Particularly thanks for your contribution last night. We will talk to you about that subject again in the future. Every Wednesday, I think, a little segment. Okay, so... Watch out for Chris in the morning, and I'll see you guys next time we see you. Take care, all of you!